Hi everybody, welcome to another World War Doe video. I hope you're all doing very, very well today. Um, just want to showcase some more live gameplay. Uh, hopefully you enjoy it. Like the last one, it was a lot of fun. I just like playing live and calling the march as I see it, you know, so I'm getting a lot of good feedback. Mm -hmm. Just want to say thanks so much to uh, Blake Pennington uh, for the kind comments that we got featured on the newsfeed. The top five um, World War II YouTubers, which was honoured to be a part of. It was amazing. Thanks so much to the developers for that. Uh, I also want to say thank you very, very much to uh, my, my club, uh, Creative Waterfall. Uh, it's the best experience that you can have in the game playing in this club. It's so good. Uh, so I'm just going to try a couple of live matches and see how we go. I know there's been a bit of issues with the power ranking. Uh, a few people have been complaining about it and yeah, it's not ideal. It's very hard to, to push but at the end of the day, it's just numbers you're, you're obtaining. And I still love playing the game and uh, trying to grow the game but I, I do believe that the power ranking will be fixed, you know, I don't think there'll be an issue. So we're coming up against a guy called Simfusion from 420 Do. We played before and I think he's featured on this channel before so give him a good luck. Got my side book in hand so we're going in this side. Could be a robot deck this guy's running. So I'm just going straight in there. Let's try a person eating plant my cyborg. Dear me, that's a, a new one. So we get that tail down pretty good. We've got to play a major here for the piranhas. Uh, and he's got, well, little friend, the heel bot. But we're not going to worry about that at the moment because. The tower's pretty low, but we're not going to worry about this. We're going to go in here and take that out, get some damage on the tower, hopefully take the tower out and the heel bolt, so that works out pretty well for us. He's got a mammoth coming in, so we're going to disco that at the last minute and try and take it out. He is going pretty hard on our tower here, so we've got to be a bit careful. Hopefully we can get the major fire down just to finish off the remnants of that. He's got his own major fire, so we've got to overclock our heel. Uh, and I think that could be all, all she wrote. Uh, we're going to go up in the air as quick as possible. We don't need to because we've won the game. So, that was a nice start to the day. Good game, Simp Fusion. Uh, always a pleasure. So we've got 12 trophies there, so that's that's decent. So we'll try another match and see how we go. I think it's very important as well, guys, that you're using the skin that works best with your deck. Uh, I watched somebody playing yesterday who was using the zombie skin. Um, now it baffled me because there's a guy from VIP something or other. Um, it baffled me because this guy was using the zombie skin. Now that skin brings opponents back, uh, your troops potentially back to life. Now this guy was running a spell cycle deck, so you're not really getting the benefit from that, you know. So we're gonna shut that down initially. He's got da chopper, da chopper. Okay, which is alright, you know. So he's got that, we've got to overclock to get rid, major fire behind, do a bit of damage and force him to retreat, go in here with a Cyburk, which is alright, you know, it's doing okay here. Get a bit of damage on his tower, and then retreat with the Yetlin's coming in, push our witch opposite lane, and put an RP mine down, heal up, then overclock. So that mod sign is going to be mitigated with that. Witch. And what we're going to do next is just run a mage up at the back. A witch here. I love this quick cycle deck, you know. I don't know why you played them. Um, bunch of piranhas there. So we're going to go up in the air just so we don't take any damage from the caveman. Put a bee mine behind. Bad play, Robert. Bad play indeed, sir. However, we might be okay here. We're going to shut that down. Chase him down a bit. Which is absolutely fine. We've got another B mine down. We've got to overclock our heel. Everything dies there. Just 
coming back in, I believe. Hopefully it does, because we're going to play Major Fire right behind him. So we're going to take that out with this. Major here. Overclock that. Cyborg, B mine, overclock. And here. Just in time for a power move. And heal up at the same time. And we should hopefully have done enough here. And he gets, uh, gets hit by the B mine there. And that's good night, Vienna. So we'll try another match and see how we go. I hope you're enjoying the gameplay, guys. I, I love playing the game, as I say, and uh, just showcasing basically Cybok and the deck that I built around him. Um, I know there's loads of other cards you can use in this game, loads of other decks that are viable. Um, personally, I believe in just upgrading the one deck and making a success out of it. A lot of people like to spend the gold over different decks, which is fine, you know, especially on YouTube, you know, you probably want to make your content um, available for all um but I, I do get good feedback from this and until that stops then i'm <laughs> I'm, I'm still going to do it uh, so yeah yeah i do appreciate each and every one of you i'm um, at 98 subscribers at the moment so if we get another two subscribers i might do something a bit uh off the wall so to speak uh might change my accent for the that video might you know it's just something different might try uh, an american accent you know bring out my inner Marty McFly or something. So we'll give this guy a good luck. And we've got my cyborg second in cycle, so just watch what I do here. Overclock, cyborg, get rid of that hot bot. Cyborg's blasting at the tower, get rid of this while we've got my heal move up. Or power move, sorry. And just look at the damage that that's done already. Don't know what that is, that a witch? Yeah, that's fine. So, in this case, we shall put a major here, three door for five door, should be a takeout. Yeah, so then we'll put a B mine there. If you get the hot bolt straight away, then you can blast it with a B mine. So that's cool. Uh, overclock my heal, cyborg again. Blast that away, don't fix what's not broken. And that is heal tower gone. Major here, be mine here. Shut down here. Overclock here. Heal up. And retreat for the time being. So yeah, we're looking pretty tasty in this one as well. So here comes the heal bot again, which I'm I'm okay with. I'm gonna play a cyborg at the back. And that takes care of that without taking too much damage. And we've got a cyborg coming down the lane. We've got to push a witch up this side. Be mine here. And take this out as quick as we can. And that should be a good night, Vienna. a little bit here. Oh, mine's got to blow that up. We're going to disc with that. Maybe a bad move, but that's what it is, you know. And then go we'll side up this side, take out the bot first. Be mine over here. 30 seconds remaining. Power move initiated. Disc with that. And re entry for the win. The guys are obviously giving up, so that's okay. We'll just play a cyborg for fun. We'll clock that. 
and just wait eight seconds until the time runs out. So that was another nice match there. Um, all going pretty well this morning. So 31 out of 250. So we'll try one more, I think, um, just to see how we go. And I, I'm hoping that the, the rankings, uh, the power rankings do improve over, over time. So yeah, really loving the game, loving the direction it's going in. I just don't want that to be a, a sticking point for the game, you know. So uh, I'm, I'm sure the developers are very active and very community focused. So I, I do see a lot of people that aren't too amused with the power at the moment. Um, as I say, to me it's just numbers, I just love playing the game, but I get where people are coming from, so uh, yeah, I'm sure they will listen. So well, this will probably be the last match of the video guys, we'll do this, I just want to make the channel just all about gameplay and just giving tips and tricks and interacting, I try to read every comment, as I say. Uh, we've got a guy called Mad Chopper here. Uh, somebody, Blake Pennington, commented saying how much he loved it. Um, the, the guys with Dark Side, uh, I've got a lot of time for them as well. Uh, I'm not going to give up, buddy. Don't you worry about that. I should give up with that sidewalk placement right enough. So he's just got a side up on deck, which is A OK with me, sir. Trip Shop, the one we're going to get there on time. Nope, so he's got a witch. Be mindful of that, especially with Sire Bomb. Uh, so we're going to use a major here for that actually. Just with this game being a bit more expensive now. Here's a fan gun, so we're going to open the air and down. You can bubble shield all you want, buddy. I'm a okay with that as well. So he's catching us with a B mine, which is fine. We're going to heal up. Uh, over this side, which this side, just to keep the Julian pressure on. Side up here. Hopefully, take his heel out. And his other tower's going to be cast as well. So that's pretty cool. Yep, so he's going with the dynamite again. Which is fine, we should have enough to. Should have enough, sorry, to uh, win this one, I hope. He's probably got to go Van Gun again, so at, the, at this point, I'm not going to take the cheerleaders out because I know he's got to come with Van Gun. It's always good to remember your opponent's card cycle. And he's got B mine as well. So normally I'll keep my Witch for Van Gun, but at this point, I'm going to use your rear entry. Damage up major fire gets guys, and we're gonna hit everything there and the tower. And he's got to probably play a B mine, which is absolutely fine because we'll go the other way. We're cursed, but we just overclock that. He's cursed himself, major there. So we're going to try and take us out with a bomb here, which he could do. This could be very close. This is a he played this really well, I've got to say. He's played this excellent, well played. And he's giving us a bit of BN as well, which is cool. Which is cool. Um, so yeah, let's see, we've lost quite a few there. Uh, we're gonna try one more. We'll try one more and see. I don't like ending on a loss, but I mean, he played that well, so you're bomb, you know? You've got to give, give kudos where kudos is due. So we're searching for a match here. Hopefully we can get into one quite quickly. I was maybe a bit too confident in that when I actually thought I had it wrapped up, but the Sire Bomb caught me at the end. I do lose the majority of my matches for being too aggressive. So we've got a guy called Nick from Natural Clan. I think I've played this guy before as well. I wonder if it's a killbot deck. Here we go. Quite a good bit of damage on that. We're going to retreat, and what I like doing in this instance is placing a witch down so that the hot bot takes the cast. I'm hoping, yes, it does. Superb. Right, so we're going to place a B mine here so that that blows up without any major issue or concern. Uh, oh, clock that. Heal up. 
just fly over there because we want to be hit the poison trail and take that out as well. So he's got a witch coming in, so we're going to use our disco ray for that. Got the magic word. Now, and then the buck. And we're on a pretty good spot at the moment. And as he's just used his witch, I'm going to get some damage in this. And he's coming back with us. We've got our witch back in action. So we're going to get out of there. Place a witch over here. And hopefully that'll take the cast of the hot bot. Which it does do so. So here's here's our little friend back again. So we're going to take that out. He's uh, place a bee mine here. Major here. And just probably get back to bot here. Shut down. And we're absolutely fine with that. We'll heal up. He's just in, in a bit of a bad position. We're we'll back to our disco. Hopefully, yep, just in time. So here comes the bot coming in this lane. I'm just going to take that out without any issue or concern. There's a witch up here just to keep the pressure on and collect our door eventually. So that's that tower cost as well. I'm going to go airborne because that can't hit what well, ain't on the ground. If you didn't know, now you know. And a major here. And a B mine here. And a disco here. And just retreat. Overclock this. He locked this. Re entry this. Retreat, retreat, retreat. My little friend is back. And we've got 18 seconds remaining. Um, quite happy with how things have progressed in this one. We did take a bit of a loss, but I'm happy, happy enough just to say up to end the game. Just to get that extra tower there. And that was a good game. I really enjoyed that. Yeah, we one loss in amongst that, guys, which um, the guy played really well with Sire Bomb, so you've got to take the, the losses with the wins. As you can see, you only got five trophies there for a guy that's top 130 or whatever he was. So, yeah, it can be quite difficult. I, I get where people are coming from with the power. But, um, yeah, that's just for now, guys. Uh, just want to say thanks very much. I've got a video coming soon featuring the Dude A and McCulge. Uh, it should be up by tomorrow. And uh, as I say, I'm really enjoying playing the game, enjoying the comments, the feedback. Um, I'm enjoying the clan I'm in. So all is good in the hood, as they say. So two more subscribers to 100. And I will be absolutely delighted to do something special for that. Um, but for now, guys, as always, take care.